In this video, we'll take a quick look at how to check if a string in JavaScript contains another substring. So let's open up the browser console so we can do some experimenting here. And what we'll do is we'll just define this test string. And this can be something. And then we can do, uh, this one will be the substring. And maybe this will be thing. Okay, so there are two methods, two different uh, approaches that we can use for this. The one that is maybe a little bit more clean is going to be test string dot includes, and then we can check if it includes the substring. This will work most places besides Internet Explorer, and a really straightforward and simple way to do this. So this will be true if we were to replace this substring with something that's not there, then that would be false. Okay, the other way that we can do this is to check the index of, and this will work in Internet Explorer. This will work everywhere. Um, so then we'll do substring here, and then what we want to do is check if this equals negative one. Actually, we want to check if it does not equal negative one. And if this evaluates true, then it contains the string. So that's true. Basically, what's happening here is this index of is checking what index substring has within test string. Okay, so that's going to be four. And as long as it's not negative one, then it, it is included. If it is not included in there, say something random, then this is going to return negative one. So those are the two different methods, either using index of check if it's not equal to negative one, or using includes. And that is how you check if a string contains a substring in JavaScript.